Welcome. My name is Dr. Mark Johnson. I'm a professor in the School of Business at Wake Forest University. I have the opportunity to speak with one of our, one of our recent graduates, Natalie Pavla. Natalie, would you like to tell us a little bit about yourself? Yes, um, my name is Natalie Pavla and I graduated recently, um, Go Deeks, with a focus in business analytics. And um, I've been in medical devices for over a decade and I am a sales consultant at a medical device company. Great. So I obviously know you very well because you were a student sitting in the front row of my course while you were at Wake Forest University. Mm -hmm. You mind telling us a little bit about your experience and what led you to choose Wake Forest? Yes, absolutely. I wanted an on-ground experience, which was absolutely non-negotiable. And I also wanted a local university um, for the networking, but also to be able to continue those relationships that I formed with the faculty and other um, students as well. And you obviously chose our Charlotte Evening Program. Mm -hmm. I'm a mother, I have two children, and the Evening Program was a very good fit for our family. It was two nights a week, um, still a big commitment, but um, my children are young still, and they're usually um, in bed while I was in class, and I could um, go in and give them a kiss goodnight when I got home, so it really um, was a good dynamic for our family. How would you say it was juggling your career, your family, and being a full-time graduate student? So the joke in our family was that we were all in school. So as a parent, it was, um, it was a very powerful way to set an example for the next generation. Um, as far as um, juggling, I believe that um, the evening program is very special because it teaches grit and resiliency. And I strongly believe that it shows you know, current employers, future employers that um, we're efficient, we can meet deadlines, and we can juggle anything. What would you say, uh, knowing that our program is cohort based, mm -hmm. did, how was that uh, going through the program, knowing that you had a dedicated team that you could go through the different courses and topics with? So I believe it was a very positive experience having um, this, a cohort and having a team that continued throughout your different core classes. For example, one of the fondest memories uh, from being on a team all the way through the two years was when we won our simulation for our global strategy class. That was a big, big win that felt, felt really good. And it felt like we were really getting the true rounded experience um, in the program. That's awesome. And you obviously yeah. chose a concentration while you were here in our Charlotte Evening MBA program. What went into your decision to choose the concentration that you chose? It was a very tough decision choosing between the finance program and the analytics. I just felt for my particular um, career path and where I saw myself long term that business analytics um, would be a good technical foundation. The skill set is very in demand, um, but I knew that I wanted to fit some other um, higher level um, finance classes in as well to really round out my experience. So obviously you were working while you were a student here in the MBA program in Charlotte. Did you ever have a lecture or a course where some of the same concepts and theories that you were learning about, you had the opportunity to apply them almost in real time in your, in your role? Absolutely, the, um, the application was immediate um, in my career. So first with the, um, the conditioning to recognize patterns and to think outside the box and really take what we learned in the classroom and apply those in real time um, and apply them quickly and efficiently. Um, secondly was a strategic piece. Um, I was negotiating with um, an account over pricing and um, just remembered um, what I learned in class, just you know, it kept repeating in my head and um, I, I landed the business. So that was a that was a big big win. I wouldn't be able to do that without um, my training through the MBA program. How would you describe your experiences in different organizational behavior, accounting, marketing, strategy? How would you describe those uh, courses and exchanges with these uh, experts in these fields? I always sat in the front row, so I was able to actually engage, you know, with professors um, during breaks or after class to really get a better understanding of their experiences and um, how the um, concepts would be applicable outside. And you have your MBA now. It's a great accomplishment that you spent years working on. What would you say to someone, a student here in Charlotte that is on the fence and he or she doesn't know if they want to pursue an MBA? What would you say they may want to consider? An MBA will do two things for you. First, it'll round out your professional experience um, and you'll be able to echo and strengthen um, areas that you have experience in or passions. The second reason is to fill in the gaps. Where are you lacking? Where can you strengthen? Where, where can you really challenge yourself? And where can you grow in your professional career? 
not only does Wake Forest have a great reputation, Charlotte is an epicenter for growth. It is one of the fastest growing uh, metros in the nation, and it's really exciting to be a part um, of the Wake Forest um, Charlotte campus in the evening program.